One reason I love living in Shanghai is how many neighborhoods there are that celebrate the connection of old with new, of Chinese culture with other cultures, and of humans with nature. I want to show you three different spots that capture this spirit for me. I love coming back to them over and over again because this idea of connection is inspiring. It demonstrates the possibility for creativity that exists when city planners and architects are committed to reaching out across the boundaries of time and space. The first spot is the oldest. The Shintiandi neighborhood renovation was planned 20 years ago by the architect Ben Wood. The footprint and many of the structures are a reflection of Shanghai Shukaman architecture from the 19th century. But the outdoor dining and many of the shops have an international 21st century vibe. One shop I love in Xintiandi is this one, Nan Shufang. It is a celebration of traditional Chinese crafts, traditional furniture, musical instruments, tea, calligraphy, kun opera but it is all being done by gifted contemporary craftspeople, and the shop makes these things accessible to visitors from overseas. The second spot is newer. The South Bun neighborhood was developed around the time of the Shanghai Expo in 2010, and it features a set of very special art museums. The Power Station of Art is the hub of this area. It was renovated from a real power station from long ago and converted into a tremendous place to encounter modern art. It is the home of the Shanghai Biennale, the oldest biennial art exhibition in China, and it is also home to a changing set of exhibitions. Currently, three exhibitions are on display. One is about silk, a second is about trees, and a third is about the Belgian artist Hergé and his Tintin cartoons. One of the things I learned from the exhibit was about Hergé's friendship with a Chinese artist that was forged in Belgium and that influenced his style of drawing. We often sing about how the future's in Shanghai, and this third spot really captures that point. This is going to be the new campus of NYU Shanghai next year, here in the Tiantan neighborhood of the Pudong district. Tiantan has been planned to incorporate new urbanist design principles through which the different parts of people's lives, from home to work to entertainment, are all integrated in a single neighborhood. And our new campus will be one of the true jewels of Tiantan. The architects at Cone Peterson Fox designed it to express our university's cosmopolitan spirit integrating multiple architectural and cultural traditions together with values of environmental sustainability, celebrating everything from the beauty of a hundred-year-old tree to the newest thinking about neural networks. This is a very special city, and I feel incredibly lucky to call it my home.